Hey guys, it's Jesse with Green Cheek Gardens. I'm back. It's been a long time, probably two, three months. Um, a lot has been going on in our lives. All good things for the most part. And um, we are in the new grow room we've been building. So I wanted to make a video to get back in the YouTube swing and uh, show you guys the awesome stuff we got going on here. So let's go. Welcome back. So before we go any further, I just want to kind of tell you where we've been in the last two, three months, however long it's been. It's felt like eternity. Um, me and my wife bought a house, and so we've been working on the house, which has kept me busy for a long time. And uh, also, obviously, working on this grow room. I meant to record a lot more along the way, but life gets in the way. And uh, so we're just going to talk about what we've got going on here first. Um, basically, this basement was a storage room of sorts with a lot of pictures on the wall. I've got some video that I took, a real quick video, just of what this place was and uh, so you can kind of see where we've came came to from there. Um, and we did a lot of taking stuff out, packing stuff up. Uh, so we got this whole place cleared out and then we came back in with a lot of tarp and uh, like greenhouse plastic and uh, lined the whole ceiling the whole sides of the walls, uh, the floor is concrete so we didn't have to worry about it. Uh, just to keep the humidity in and keep the humidity from you know, spreading throughout the house obviously. Um, so that took a little while, uh, we got that done. Then we started putting in a bunch of shelves, I had to buy more because I didn't have near enough and a ton of lights and we installed all the lights in here. So basically that was the setup for the grow room. Um, and then after that, we started the migration of plants from over at my house over to the new place. And uh, so they're over here. We're still not living here. Um, still working on the upstairs and stuff like that. But wanted to get my plants all, you know, set up and cozy and uh, ready to grow. So I'm going to take you around and show you some of the groups we got, you know, what we got set up uh, where. And uh, so let's just go ahead and see what we got. So this is the back wall. This is where all my big plants are. A lot of monsteras, a lot of mints, uh, albos. Just a bunch of pretty stuff that we've been collecting. I know I've showed a lot of videos of opening uh, plants and stuff like that, but we have a ton more that uh, I've been buying along the way um, while I haven't been making videos. So we've got plenty of videos that'll be coming out. Um, we've got a lot of prop uh, stations over here. And then uh, right here, is uh, basically the, the rarest of the rare plants we've got. Um, there's some alocasia, some philodendron, uh, just some really, really pretty plants uh, and very hard to come by. The other side, we got some big plants too, um, a bunch of mother alocasia plants that are already pretty large. Here's that big stingray uh, that I've had for a while. You've saw some videos of it. Newest leaf just about to come out there. Uh, and then a, a big... Uh, Regal shield in the background there. Down here at the bottom, I have all of my begonias growing uh, in lower light, which begonia likes for better color. Um, and they're obviously in a really high humidity chamber there. Um, so we'll go through some begonias too. I don't think I've really shown begonias on the channel at all. And uh, they're definitely a, a finicky plant. And uh, they've, they've been challenging for me, but we've done all right with them. If we go over to the other side of the room, We've got a bunch of TC plants that are still acclimating and uh, just kind of setting in the greenhouse. Uh, got a ton of those. A lot of alocasia in there. And then on the other side is kind of where I've already propped stuff and it's just here growing until it's ready to sell. Um, so skindapsis over here. Um, let's see, a lot of pothos, really pretty pothos. And just a lot of uh, a lot of stuff that's little tiny things, and we want to get good light on it and uh, let those roots get to grow on. 
Got a ton of Syngonium over here. This has been the newest, uh, I guess, addiction I got going on. Syngonium, there's a million of them out there, so there's a ton to collect, uh, and I'm not even close, but we're on the way. Got a lot more Alocasia up top, and we got a lot of Philodendrons down bottom. Actually, most of these are uh, Monstera albos that we've got growing over here. We've got the huge Golden Dragon still growing. You want to see that baby get... Get big. All right, so that's what we've got growing on here in the grow room. And um, in the future, we're going to have plenty of videos on propagating stuff, um, experiments with different soil substrates. Uh, I know that was a pretty popular one. Um, definitely do some corm hunting. Um, and with all the various plants we've got here, I'm sure we'll be running other different types of tests too, just uh, to have fun. We love growing plants. Propagating is my favorite part. So there'll be plenty to tune in and watch. Uh, if you guys like this video, make sure to like and subscribe. And I'm Jesse with Green Chick Gardens. We'll see you next time.